Thank preface, we've done all this. Yeah. Um, the second page of the preface. Lovely. And then we go notes on the paintings. Yeah. One, two, three. One, uh -huh. two, three. Correct. Blank, and then we come to the first the image. Yeah. Marvellous with that black and white roll Yeah. It's in steam blind children. And second time, any Next one. It's we're very fortunate in that it the structure works. Yes. Mm. Mm. Two. Yeah. And I've um, the longest poem is about it's got two more lines in this. Yes. So that still works. I've actually dropped it, because we've taken off the title. Yeah. I've dropped it and proposed that that runs through, that yes. line there. Right, okay. Sounds great. Okay, lovely. All right, I'll just have a look at some of this type setting there, John, on the video. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah. This is the preface. Simon's preface for the book. Hello. Yes. And I would say it was well, going to be a mix. So we're trying to match the blue twelve. Yeah. Or we'll get somewhere closer. Yeah. Than the blue 12, well, which yeah. is quite a tricky one to do. Yeah. I mean, if I think that's probably it, but I would want to step it down to that. Yeah. And that will, and then it will look, it'll look darker because it's in type as I keep. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Well, shall we give that a whirl? Well, yeah. I mean, it's a, it's a mix. Bloody horrible mix. Is it? <laughs> well, look, six parts, three, two parts, three parts, eleven parts. Oh wow. So, okay. Horrible. I should have scales. Two. I'm sure we'll get pretty close here. Mm -hmm. Right, and then it's uh... Oh, that was the violet, wasn't it? That was the violet, no, yeah, so... Violet. So was it three parts violet? Yeah, yeah. And then it was, uh, yeah, it was uh, process blue, it was a one, isn't it? Yeah. Just a bit. What about it? Yeah, looks good. It's a voice that is, is very deep, very low, it's almost masculine. But it's also very feminine. You, you're just going to add the transparent white later then? Yeah, yeah. Right, okay. Yeah. I'm going to add this to the transparent white. Right, okay. This, believe it or not, is a transparent white. <laughs> End of tin. <laughs> Looks like butterscotch at the moment. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. Oh. It's an incredible colour, this one. It's not how you imagine white. No. The, obviously, the paint white is very. I mean, you bought that tin in about 1934, did you, John? <laughs> yeah. I, 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 I've had it a long, long time, yeah. That's about it, isn't it? I would have said so. To my inexpert eye. Let's see what you end up with. 
And she right. likes it. She stays in a room on the top floor. Has a window open at night so she can hear the sound of the parrots. So we're trying to match a blue 12, or Johnny's trying to match a blue 12, from a Harmerton leather. And this will be for the title of the book. And we always like the title of the book to match the quarter leather binding that we use. Well, it's not that far off, I don't think. Well, it'll screen pretty good now. Let's see how it prints. Excellent. On to the rollers. Spreading the ink over the rollers here. And then this is the title. Uh, just to see, curious to see what colour this is. Yeah, okay. Alright. Oh, you can see it's blue. But yeah, it is blue. That's one? Yeah, so I'm just using this as the. Just get this position. position. Just check everything. article. It's pretty darn good as far as I'm concerned that. So that should so be that, right. That, that's right. Yeah, that's okay. my lay that way. Yeah. Obviously I don't adjust any of those once I start. Right. Then, then that is a fixed amount. Yeah. That's for the 36M there. For right. The, but the poems are on 28. And, uh, and that's fixed there. 20M's there. Nice. So we're going to start the print for real. Yeah. yeah. Okay. John's going to roll these through one at a time. Um, just over a hundred sheets of them. So this is going to be printing the collar font. That's the typeset. As usual, we're using a, a centre, 16. Yeah, yeah. Uh, John's just placed it on the, the bed. And he's now going to arrange the furniture around it. Cleaning down the rollers, getting the mix of the blue ink that we did for the title page off the rollers. Before we put some black on for the printing of the colophon. I wish my paintbrushes came as clean as quickly as that does. They never do. A trial run with the colour pan sheet. Here we go. So we see how it's looking. I think we've got to drop that, same as the poems. Yeah. yeah. It's got to come a bit further down yeah. the page. Yeah. yeah. So we've got to drop it. That means rearranging the furniture. That's better. Oh, it's looking good, John. It's looking good. Beautiful. Mm -hmm.